If you want to see dramatic tension between boxers and the ring, you should definitely watch our picks for the best classic boxing movies. Cheers now for Rocky Balboa. Suddenly, Moscow is pro-Rocky. We hope you will enjoy the following ranking. Please let us know your favorite in the comments and make sure to subscribe to never miss a good movie again. Number 10. Rocky IV, 1985. Rocky IV is a sports drama film written and directed by Sylvester Stallone and stars him alongside Dolph Lundgren, Burt Young, Talia Shire, and Carl Weathers. In the world of sports, it's all about honoring your opponent. But when long-lasting boxing champion and legend Rocky sees his friend Apollo Creed being beaten to death in a match against a hulking Russian newcomer, he knows what to do. Go for one last match and fight for the legacy of his beloved friend. Rocky Balboa is in serious trouble. They might have to stop this one before somebody gets killed. Ricky Graven! Ricky Graven! Rocky's hurt. He woke the sleeping giant and now he's paying for my side. Number 9. Hard Times, 1975. We got 15 more. You bet, man? Oh, oh, wait a minute. We got another six. That's all we got. Hard Times is a crime neo noir sports film directed by Walter Hill and stars Charles Bronson, James Coburn, and Jill Ireland. Exploring the corrupt side of the famous sport, Hard Times sees a rising boxer seeking success through bets and dangerous games with mobsters. When the thrill goes wrong and his depths are unplayable, he is forced by a dangerous mobster manager to play a game where people barely make it out alive. But his greatest fight still lays ahead. Hey, Pops, you're a little old for this, ain't you? Number 8. The Boxer, 1997. The Boxer is a 1997 sports drama film directed by Jim Sheridan and stars Daniel Day Lewis and Emily Watson. Defined by the incredible performances from its leading actors, The Boxer picks up good old drama while revolving around Jim Sheridan, a professional Irish boxer. Trying to find true love and even more difficult, keeping it, while also proving his ability and class in the cage, Jim must learn to overcome his thick headedness. Box. Rick, Rick. You're not ready. You had enough, son? I'll tell you when I've had enough. Number seven. Body and Soul, 1947. Been that way for two months, boys. There's no stopping him. It's going to be a Marlow massacre. He's looking great, champ. Thanks, Pete. Feel fine. I can even name the round. Body and Soul is a noir sports drama film directed by Robert Rawson and stars John Garfield, Lily Palmer, and Anne Revere. Exploring the consequences of a failed father-son relationship, Body and Soul finds an amateur boxer gaining worldwide attention. But after the sudden death of his father, his senses are blinded for everything except his boxing success. Against the will of his mother, he loses himself in a world that is more manipulated and corrupted than he ever thought. All this monkey business with the train to run the odds up against Marlowe and you're not really trained at all. What are you ducking out on, Charlie? You can be on top for years yet. That's the way things are, Ben. That's the way they are. Number 6. Rocky II. 1979. This time, you're going to be scary, kid. You're going to be a greasy, fast Italian monster. Rocky II is a sports drama film written and directed by Sylvester Stallone and stars him alongside Talia Shire, Burt Young, Carl Weathers, and Burgess Meredith. Following the award-winning and ultimate underdog classic that was the original, Rocky II proves that there is more than enough spark left in the franchise. Once again, we can't help but root for the charismatic underdog boxer as he is challenged by his arch enemy to get back in the box ring. 
resulting in a climax that is the perfect example of suspense and pure thrill. I'm sorry, are you finished? Yeah. Can we go to work? That would be nice. Now hit that bag. Hit it. Jab it, tell it all. It's go ahead. Three, yeah. four. I want 500 high ones. Go. What was I, seven or eight? Number five. Requiem for a Heavyweight, 1962. What'd you do? You beat up two bums? That ain't gonna help. I got a whole regiment. Requiem for a Heavyweight is a sports drama film directed by Ralph Nelson and stars Anthony Quinn, Jackie Gleason, Mickey Rooney, and Julie Harris. Offering what the title already promises and much more, Requiem for a Heavyweight is the statement of a once famous boxer who fell from grace. Betrayed by a manipulative and greedy manager, he is forced to start a career as a show wrestler. Humiliated by the public and once respecting figures, he must show the world that his best match is yet to come. Look, I pay cash for services rendered and so far you ain't rendered nothing. Put me on next. You mean he'll go? Eight matches starting tonight? Yeah. With an option for 16 more? Yeah, yeah, sure, anything you say. Number four. The Hurricane, 1999. That book is the only thing I got left in here. You understand me? That's the only chance I got to get out of here. The Hurricane is a 1999 biographical sports drama film directed by Norman Jewison and stars Denzel Washington, John Hanna, Deborah Kara Unger, and Lee Schreiber. Often considered one of the, or even the best Denzel Washington performance, The Hurricane revolves around the truly devastating story of 1966 top-ranked middleweight boxer Reuben Hurricane Carter. When wrongly convicted and charged for murder, he must take one more fight to win. But this time, it is for his freedom and innocence. We, the jury, find the defendants, Reuben Carter and John Artis, guilty on all counts. Oh, no! No! Number three. The setup, 1949. I understand that he's 23 and you're 35, Bill. 35 in this business, you're an old man. The Setup is a noir sports drama film directed by Robert Wise and stars Robert Ryan and Audrey Totter. Surprising with striking intelligence and offering a twisted and smart plot in the early times of sports movies, The Setup finds a once great boxer coming near his days of retirement. Unwilled to end his career, he decides to take one last battle. What he doesn't know, his manager who lost interest in him set up an unfair game that he can't win. Or can he? Stoker can still punch. If anything goes wrong, little boy's gonna blow his top. be a meathead. Nelson will butcher him. It's a hundred to one. That's just it. There's always the one. I tell you, you gotta tell Stoker. Are you give me a bellyache? The guy's blowed a hundred fights already without anybody's help, and he ain't gonna need none tonight. Number two. Raging Bull, 1980. You want me to hit you? I want you to me with everything you got. I want you to fucking lay me out. Go ahead. You sure? Yeah. All right. Hot. Raging Bull follows the story of Jake LaMotta, a professional midweight boxer whose violence and self-destructive rage that enable him to crush his opponent in championships have become a burden on his personal relationships as he treats his loved ones with the same hostility he treats his opponents. Often considered the greatest film of the decade, Raging Bull was a critical success under the direction of Martin Scorsese. The biographical drama film stars Robert De Niro in the lead role and was released in 1980. Take it off. Ah, oh, come on. You want to stop now? Take That's enough. Okay. That. Come on. Uh, come Fuck on. around, yeah. Come on. Hey, girl, yeah. I'm going to smack you again. Throw it again. It's enough. Hey. It's enough. Hey. Hard, hard. No, your fucking cuts are opening everything. Before we unveil movie number one, here are a few honorable mentions. Hey, good. It's all right. It's all right, Billy. Check. Don't worry. Don't worry about it. Set him over here. Come on. Get out. Jerry. 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 Well, listen, while you're still calm, can we get that pole right together? Yeah, sure. Waste. Before you can get rolling, your life makes a beeline for the drain. 
Number one. Rocky, 1976. You know, I've been coming in for six years, and six years you've been sticking it to me. I want to know how come. You don't want to know. Yeah, I want to know how come. Rocky is a 1976 sports drama film directed by John G. Avildsen and is written by and starring Sylvester Stallone. It tells the rags-to-riches story of Rocky Balboa, a small-time boxer from Philadelphia, working as a debt collector for a loan shark. When heavyweight champion Apollo Creed visits Philadelphia, his managers set up an exhibition match between Creed and Rocky, touting the fight as a chance for a nobody to become a somebody. The film also stars Talia Shire, Burt Young, Carl Weathers, and Burgess Meredith. You had the talent to become a good fighter, and instead of that, you became a leg breaker to some cheap second-rate loan shark. It's a living. It's a waste of life. Do you agree with our list? Please let us know in the comments. If you want to know more about a particular movie in this list, you can check out our links in the video description. And for more top 10 movie videos, be sure to subscribe to Community TV.